senior day here for the men today. So Jesse Balser walking out to midcourt now to honor his seniors, Chris Evans. And Demetrius Isaac. Okay, thank you everybody. Now I'm gonna try my best to talk too long. It is a little difficult for me at times. Uh, first of all, I wanna thank the University of Sciences for giving us this moment. Congratulations, Flo and Will, the two seniors for sciences. Great players, and I'm not sorry to see you guys go. Best of luck in the playoffs. Um, my first senior is gonna be uh, a young man who went to Plymouth White Marsh High School nearby. Came to Chestnut Hill from a great basketball program that didn't want to play because he had a lot going on academically. So he was our manager. Andrew Conway, come on out and your parents come out with us. Nice ceremony there as Demetrius Isaac, Chris Evans, and Andrew Conboy, who, if you don't recognize that name, he's been for the past four years kind of a manager, a video guy, just sort of does it all for Chestnut Hill behind the scenes. So today they hand him a jersey and a bouquet of flowers, get the parents and attendance, the whole deal, and who knows? I think you heard Jesse Balser say they're going to try to get him into the game and get him a bucket at some point. So that would be a nice thrill for him for sure and also saw Jesse Balser give a shout out to some of the seniors on this U Sciences team that mainly Flo Silva and 
Will Gregoritz, two of the better seniors on the team, will be playing their last couple games now as collegiate. Two Sciences is playoff bound. They're locked into that number four seed in the CACC South. They will take on Bloomfield, who's one of the better teams in the country. They've been ranked for most of the year. So that will be a tough test for them. But this is uh, a very strong U Sciences team. So yet again, this is another game, much like the first one, that doesn't have any stake in the standings at all. We'll see in particular how U Sciences plays it out, if they play all of their starters all game like they normally would, or if they rest some of their guys. But their starting lineup in the backcourt, Flo the Silva leads the league in, a, in steals, rather, at 2.8 per game. He's joined by Patty Casey, 6'1 freshman guard, out of Scranton, Pennsylvania, averaging just under 12 per game. Joining him in the backcourt is Tom Gregoritz, brother of Will Gregoritz, who is a senior and one of the better players in the CACC. So that's kind of cool. They put Tom Gregoritz in the starting lineup so he can start a game with his brother, Will, who is a senior. In the front court, it is Will Gregoritz, 6'7", 220 pounds, senior forward out of Burke, Virginia. Averaging just under 15 per game, leads the team in rebounds at 9.6 per game. And Brendan Crawford, 